Hey everyone, this is Pick Manipulator, and welcome to another WiiWare demonstration. Today I'm playing Dive, the Medes Islands secret demo. Alright, seems like quite a departure from the norm here. Let's start and see what we're in for. I'll go easy, because of course I will. Spain, Medes Islands, 1412 AD. The chronicles tell us that the Knights Templar built a monastery on the edge of a cliff. Inside, they built a chapel in which they placed the tomb of King Martin and with him the secret of their order. But 200 years later, an earthquake sent the church and all of its mysteries tumbling into the sea. Now I am ready to dive into the depths of the sea and bring them once again to light. Okay. Medi... Medi... Is it per... Is it pronounced Medes? Because that would be the Spanish way of pronouncing it. Catalonia, Spain. So, we've got a map. I am currently located on this island. Uh... Treasure of Martin the First. Statistics. Log. This is my first entry in the log. The first of the great sunken treasures awaits me. I am going in search of the tomb of Martin the First, the human and its secret treasure. The Knights Templar built a monastery in the Medes Islands that sunk beneath, beneath the waves in 1552. The writings speak of an emerald dolphin that. Uh, decorated the entrance to the tomb of Martin I, the human. That's quite a plain uh, nickname to give a king, the human. Here is where I can see all the treasures and relics I've found so far. I'd like to have the complete collection. I have none. No relics either. Shop? I can buy some wetsuits. Wetsuit upgrades enable you to access a greater depth. With the basic wetsuit, you can dive to 60 feet. This it can let you dive to 390 feet, but an upgrade. 590. Eliminates the depth limits with this one, huh? I'll look at these more once I've gotten a taste of the game. Let's. Achievements. Yeah, I'll look at those later. Dive. Yeah, I have. I've read that before. So, play. Medes Islands. Goal: to find the lost treasure on this island. Continue. Press and hold the B button to move. Press the B button twice to give yourself an extra boost. Be careful, your oxygen level will drop more quickly. Okay. Oh, okay, so this is like 2D navigation. I just swim and guide where I go with the pointer. Watch out for the glint of buried jewels and chests with gold coins. Swim over them to get money. You can use the money to buy, upgrade your equipment in the store. This is your compass. The red spot shows nearby treasures. The green spots indicate supplies. The yellow star shows where the main treasure is. Oh, how handy. Ah, something's glinting. I got some, I got some jewels. Hmm. Is this as far as I can go? Okay. How do I refill oxygen? Not by swimming to the surface, because the surface blocks me. Alright, um... This guy sure is a slow, and he's not boosting. What happens if I touch this manta? I take damage. Mantas aren't supposed to do damage to humans. They're filter feeders. 
and their tails have no stings in them. Oh, uh, it appears that damage in this game equates to just losing oxygen. I assume I shouldn't touch that anemone. Or, or jellyfish. So. This is your oxygen reserve. Avoid sea creatures and enemies. They will affect your reserves. Okay. I can understand having to avoid jellyfish, but if I touch these fish, will they also... Nope. Nope, the game's not that cruel. There are many oxygen recharges on the sea floor. Look for them. You can that way you can spend a lot longer underwater. All right. So I just have to find those on the sea floor. I guess some careless divers left them there. Maybe I left them there. <laughs> okay, so... You can see a map of the zones you have explored by pressing right on the control pad. Oh. Okay, I pressed left <laughs> at first. Alright. What? Okay, I did something I was not taught to do. Pressing A apparently launches a harpoon or something. Um, uh. Let's see what's over here. Boy, this guy moves slow. You will find reloads for your tranquilizer spear gun on the sea floor. Remember that you can never carry more darts than your current spear gun allows. Okay, so it's a, a tranquilizer spear gun, not a harpoon. Thanks, thanks for clearing that up, game. Would, would tranquilizers, like, be non-lethal to sea creatures? Alright. Um, there's a treasure. I guess I'll try shooting. Okay, got rid of that jellyfish. Alright, I got $1,000 out of that chest. And I assume that's it for this area. Yep. Get away from the jellyfish. Alright. Now I begin the slow... Slow swim back to the fork. The fork in the underwater passages. I don't want to use up more oxygen than I need to. So I'm just going to take it slow. It's boring, but... I oh, want to steer clear of that inner urchin, I bet. Unless it's just a background asset. Oh, something's shining. Okay, so... Where do I want to go now? I wonder if those things are... Portuguese man of wars. Oh well. Aim and press the A button to shoot this an enemy and pass by safely. Use your darts wisely, since they are a very scarce resource. You will find reloads for your tranquilizer spear gun on the seafloor. Remember that you can never carry more darts than Yeah, I read that already. Okay, so it affects an enemies too. What's that, a beach ball? This is a checkpoint. You will start from here if you run out of oxygen. Remember that if you return to the coast of Brava, all progress will be lost. Okay. Uh, so it's like a little buoy. Or 
something like that. Um, why would I want to waste um, a spear just to get another spear? Oh, urchins! Didn't notice them. But I got um, I got a jewel out of that, so. I hope I can find an oxygen tank soon. Swim over this jellyfish. Be careful. The alarm warns you that you are reaching your current depth limit. Who knows what is hidden in the depths of this island. When you get enough money, you can upgrade your wetsuit. Come back later to finish exploring it. But if I return to Costa Brava, all my progress will be lost. There's a, an oxygen tank. Lucky for me. Okay, so I don't want to continue further down. Yep, there looks like there's plenty to still explore above. Do spears work on urchins, I wonder? But I won't fire one unless I feel like I have to. Uh, a pearl. Alrighty. Back. Back this way. To these long medusas. Shoot that thing. Uh, is that a lionfish? Oh, that, it looks unfriendly. I should probably steer clear. Um, sure is a lot over this way, so I think I'll grab that. I'll grab this oxygen tank before moving on. Hmm. Well, might as well test this out now. No, it doesn't work on urchins. By the way, those are giant urchins I just noticed. I can evade these things. Okay, I'm not so confident here. Now. Where are you, Martin the First? Mr. The Human? What makes you more human than the rest of us? I want to find out. Pressing left on the control pad activates a, a flashlight. So that's cool. Um, am I gonna have to... All right, looks like I'm entering some ruins now. I'm on the right track. Switch your torch on and off by pressing left on the control pad. Yeah, it just explains that. Dark areas. I guess I'm in an area sufficiently dark enough. It's, that's a dolphin. I don't know if it was in the background or not, but if it was in the... The same area as me. You have found the lost treasure for the asylum. Pick it up to complete your expedition. If it was on the same level as me, then touching it did not hurt me. No, it's in the background. So this is the treasure. Alright. 
The treasure is yours. You can continue exploring this island or return it to it later. Would you prefer to return to the coast of Brava? I guess so. I'm not going to lose all my progress though, right? Okay, there is no trace of the secret treasure. I have, however, found one of the dolphins that adorns the entrance. I do not know what it might represent, but I cannot stop here any I cannot stop here any longer. I must go on to Madeira to continue my search. My team detected a high concentration of metals to the north of the islands. And I say yes according to the I I say yes in response to this. Alright. First treasure. Achievements. Oh, divers like challenges. You will be awarded one medal for each of your achievements. Let's see. All small treasures. Three hours diving. Diving magnate. Cool. Is this all the achievements? Guess there's not a whole lot to this game. But it's... Okay. Interesting. Bottle of rum. <laughs> Pirate's favorite liquor. Whoa. So. Emerald Dolphin. This is still uh, exceeding my expectations. I mean, the gameplay may not necessarily be fun. It's pretty slow, but... Now I'm currently located on this island, the Golden Chest. Completed the treasure of Martin the First. Or Meta Meta's Islands. Now I'm at the Desert Islands. Okay, let's gonna check my time so Alright, let's dive. Oh nope, that's that's it. Uh Darn, I should have visited the shop, the shop to see what I could afford. Anyway, this is just a small sample of what awaits you in the complete game. Explore islands from around the world and discover the most amazing treasures. Upgrade your equipment. Dive to the depths and uncover the secret of the Medes Islands. Alright, so that's the extent of the demo. Let's head to the Wii Shop channel. Dive. The Meta's Island Secret. For one player, compatible controllers, it only requires the Wii Remote. And it costs $10. Well, over, let's see. Over the past five centuries, hundreds of ships flying every ensign have succumbed to the power of the ocean. Merchant boats, pirate ships, navy vessels, all of them have ended up covered with coral at the bottom of the oceans around the planet. But all of them guarded secrets that remained hidden over the years. Secrets that have always been a mystery. Until now. In Dive, the Meta's Island's secret, you are John Sanders, a treasure hunter and experienced diver who spends months planning and documenting a major expedition to locate and recover several ships of different ensigns around the world. Alrighty. It is certainly an interesting, pre uh, interesting premise that captures my attention. And the gameplay is a lot slower than I'd want it to be, though, I'm afraid. I, maybe they're aiming for realism, but... Anyway, that's been my demonstration of Dive. What do you guys think? I'm heading to the next WiiWare demonstration now, and I'll see you all then.